Hey guys, we go back to my channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share if you're new here. So today I'm just going to show you guys about my day as an offline English teacher. So I have an English job, but this morning I I received a call from the visa office to go get a particular document because my visa is expiring. So I had to get a new registration you know before my visa is out so i forgot to to set my car camera well i noticed that my video was my recording was actually on slow-mo you know so most of these videos you're going to watch right now is actually slow-mo and we just talk about how i got my job so I got my job from Avito, filled my CV and all, and I got a job in Cooks here, like for a space of being a teacher in a speaking club. So I work offline on Saturdays, you know, and for this particular school, I actually have adult clients that I teach on Tuesdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. So um i went to the visa office to sort out things but it went well per se i thank god because this morning i was panicking i was scared but i realized there's not something deep it's just that i needed a, a registration document to sustain me back here while my visa is is, is not yet out you know so my friend Kemi is a co-worker she's actually my friend we're close friends for years like more than four years if i'm not mistaken but we work together at the same school i'm so happy and this is my first english um speaking club and i get to work with my friend and another person another friend too her name is Edie young so um you know during the vlog you're going to see we're going to see a did young yeah so kemi should be here yeah kemi is here already and of course i styled her <laughs> fashionista a lot more you know that introvert that introverted friend who does not who does not who doesn't know that she actually needs to be a model like if she's a model we are going to cash out but she's she doesn't just want to be out there so you can see she's so pretty and she has this model like she has the body she has the big figure she has the beauty bonnet so what do we do as a friend we style her we turn her to our own model you know so we're all dressed you can see classy babes imagine going for your first job your first offline speaking club and you're dressed like this the girls are dressed like this there is no way the children are going to like us look at the sleigh the glasses the glasses is given everything is given like i think i should take up this talent of styling people maybe i could be i could be a stylist because as you can see from the video i know i know how to do it i know who i am whatever i think i am i am can you see that sleigh so yeah now we're heading to the bus stop this is my apartment you know so we're heading to the bus stop and this is the neighborhood of my apartment and uh, this is my full outfit you can see all glammed up there is no way i will style someone else and i won't style myself well you can see my bag i told you guys i told you guys about dr brown caramel this bag is from og classy bags you should patronize okay you must patronize if you know you love me you have to patronize the brand i work with that is a classy bag and look at my classy my classy outfit it is given the glasses is given the wig is wigging do you understand and that's on period in all you do appearance matters a lot because when you meet new people you go for a job or whatever or whatever event to go you go for, you go whatever if event you attend sorry if i may say 
whatever event you attend you have to dress classy because people will address you the way you appear people address you according to your appearance do you get do you know it was at this point i noticed that we have been vlogging without sound you don't want to know what i was saying but i was dancing and singing Igbo song we were dancing and then i took this my hostel to my first job because i want to show them the african culture the dance and of course i'm going to dance for them because why not when your teacher is multi-talented why not i'm giving you a bonus <laughs> dance free dance class plus the english class is a win-win for everybody do you understand so this is my neighborhood this is like a park close to my apartment and uh, we are going, we're heading to the um, bus stop you know yeah and this is the bus stop and Kim is taking me pictures or videos i don't know yeah and i feel like at this point both of us were feeling dizzy because we're so tired since morning we're trying to well we've been trying to prepare for our first job and we're preparing for the class and all and at the end we ended up going late let's put it out there i'm so who is a late comer i i'm really trying my best to go early for appointments because uh, i do go late for appointments which is very very bad of me it's something it's one floor i'm trying to to change about myself so guys see you at my workplace and yes this is the school this is the offline english speaking club yeah welcome to my place of work <laughs> so stay tuned and enjoy this beautiful vlog okay bye <laughs> information and some things that you don't know and you guys you will introduce your country mm -hmm. and you will tell us some interesting facts that we don't know about Nigeria. Итак, у нас сегодня первый раз такой интересный разговорный клуб. Мы раньше проводили в основном его только с российскими педагогами, с российскими преподавателями, а сегодня мы пригласили. Okay. What about you? Go away. Okay. Wonderful. So our first destination is a wonderful and a wide country. It's the biggest in the world, yeah. Uh, and our country is called Russia, yeah. So could you guys show Russia on the map? Could you show it? Maybe it's Russia. Yeah. And show me. I don't know. Yes, please. I'm being stupid today, so that's why I'm <laughs> Maybe this is Russia. Women and yeah. the teachers is active. This is part, this is little part, yeah? Ah, this is little part, yeah, what? This is, this is Russia. This is Russia. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah. uh, this one.
weather, maybe um, I don't know. More than food. one. Hmm? Can do more than one. It's okay. You can have just one or more. The than one. Russian soup. No, no, <laughs> Russian soup. Russian soup. Which one? It. Which one? I don't eat. Um, I don't eat <laughs> any old continent. I only eat African. Food. Wow. Really? How do you manage that here? Bring from I, I bring country. from Nigeria. Yeah. So yeah, I don't force it. Yeah. You, you don't cook any Russian food? You don't eat any Russian food? No. Wow. Only, we only eat like maybe yes. steak. Yes. yes. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. I see. And oh, then you plov. eat your food. Yeah, yeah. The rice. Plov. Right? Huh? Yeah. Because I think it's similar. It, it's it's similar. Yes. Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah. 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 Okay. So, 10, 9, 8. Uh, so, look at Didi. She drew what? She drew something. What is it? Can you give us something? What is it? It's her association with Russia. What is it? It doesn't sound Yeah, Russia. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? What is the name? It's my name. <laughs> it's my floor. <laughs> yeah, but also, the, the color is purple. It's everywhere in Russia. It is still the You can buy Yeah. So we just go like a circle, yeah? What yeah. should we do, guys? Yeah. We have to yeah. just think hands, yes, and make a circle and just go. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, so we can like do it this. like this. Yes. All we so can uh, run. <laughs> we can run also. <laughs> Okay. A lot than the city was like. Yes. 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 So uh, Julia is surprised that you live in Russia. You have been living six Russia years. six years, and Not you no. don't speak Russian. Because so everybody well. in my house, in my school, in my class, we are we are Malaysians, Indians. No, yeah, so English, well, not, it's, it's English, English we speak. Malaysia, India, yeah. Nigeria. So what they are doing? So they are. Everybody can understand only English. Все все общаются между собой только на английском языке, потому что девочки учатся на отделении в университете, где преподают на английском языке. So in, и они знают, что они там ну, совсем, совсем маленькие. So in my opinion, if if Russia wants foreigners to the language is beautiful. We want to learn. But we we are the Gen Zs. This is a generation. Even we love music, we love movies. We love movies. We have crush on celebrities, you know. So bring the faces. You, your your actors are beautiful, fine. Russians are beautiful people. Plus, Perfect.